It's Tuesday, that means it's time for YouTube news. The most important thing to happen this past week, in my opinion, was Mr. YouTube, and I have a few thoughts and few news worthy notes to say about that. To no one's surprise at all, Shane Dawson won, got almost a third of the votes cast. This shows how much he truly dominates on YouTube. Massive congratulations to you, Shane. The runner up, of course, Ray William Johnson, who campaigned like nobody else on Blog TV, on Twitter. Massive congratulations to him as well. And rounding out the top five were Waste Time Chasing Cars, Fluffy Talks, and Cool Jeffrey. Massive congratulations to the top five. And for those of you who didn't watch Buck's behind the scenes of Mr. YouTube. It's on the Prone 75 channel. I'm going to link it in the sidebar. There's a whole long backstory of why it took so long to count the votes. You should definitely check that video out. And um, yeah, I was so happy and excited to count the votes and compile all the results for you, Buck. You are awesome. I would do anything for you. Much love. Something I found so hilarious this week, Fail Blog was featured and they had this whole special behind the scenes at Fail Blog video that they put out and YouTube was just all over Fail Blog this week. They used to hide Fail Blog from the top 100 and they would um, shut down Fail Blog's channel like every other week and now they are sucking at the two to Fail Blog because of course they bring in them the money. But I think it's very funny to go from, you know, pounding out Fail Blog to being like, oh, Fail Blog, we love you. That was inappropriate. These next two stories that everyone probably already knows, but in case you've been living under a rock, I just want to cover it. If you have a viral video and you're not a partner, so like if you put a video out and it's getting like 100,000 views or something, YouTube's going to let you monetize it. It's their whole monetizing everyone's 15 minutes of fame. Great idea, YouTube. I am so for this. Monetize everyone's videos, in my opinion. I'm so excited to see this happen and see viral videos get the recognition and the people who made them get the money they deserve. And I know I have a lot of UKers out there that watch me, so congratulations to all of you for finally getting premium music back. YouTube finally struck a deal with PRS for Music, the UK's version of, I guess, like Universal Music Group or like the big society that controls music there in the UK. YouTube for a long time was fighting with them and not having a deal. And so UKers did not get premium music. I know I would die if that was me, but you finally have it back. Congratulations. A side note of clarification. A lot of you have been asking me why I'm not covered when people get into the 100,000 subscriber club. Well, it's because I try only cover people in the top 100. So I'm going to start trying to research a little bit better to recognize those amazing people who get the 100,000 subscribers because that is a huge deal, a big mark. But just for clarification purposes, I usually try and just focus on the top 100 on winners and losers, but I will try and tweak it now because I know you all wanted to give, hear me say a big congratulations to uh, Pogobat Dan Brown and Ray William Johnson and a uh, few other people who I can't remember right now. And now for our new up and coming YouTuber of the week. I haven't chosen a female yet, so this week I decided I'm going to choose a female. I'm going to scour the internet and find the best female there is, and I found it. I know I talk about a lot of YouTube musicians, but this is the best female musician out there. Her name is Megan Tonjes and she is amazing. She just put out her first music video and what was so awesome about it is that she asked for clips from YouTubers and her music video is just sprinkled with different clips of YouTubers in it and it's so amazing and it's people you know and love too like Michael Buckley and ex Samantha Nicole and Kristen Sane and Jay Stevens 428 and just all these wonderful amazing people and she just did such a good job and if you check out her videos you see that she totally interacts with her audience. She has this thing called Request Tuesdays where you, yes you, can send a request for a song you want to hear her sing and she will just strum it on the guitar and sing Sing it like there is no tomorrow. And once you're done checking out her YouTube, go to her website. You can just stalk her and love her even more. Follow her on Twitter. And then, of course, rate, comment, fave all the videos and subscribe to her. I'm serious. Subscribe to her. She's amazing and I love her. And you can get all of her songs on iTunes. So, yeah, I'm going to stop talking about her now because I'm just going gaga, I know. So thank you so much for checking out this week's edition of YouTube News. I hope you enjoyed. Leave all the comments you want below and blah, 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 blah. Do whatever you want to do. And I will see you on Friday for YouTube Winners and Losers. I'll be coming from a very secret location in the middle of Illinois, so it'll be interesting. You probably get to see some family members because I'm going on vacation. Stop talking, William. It's over. Bye.